Why don't you fly it for him, Chris? <laughs> I don't want to crash it. Yeah. I wish you had that earlier. You could have gotten my turbine going in. Oh, I missed the turbine crash? Yep. Damn. <laughs> what happened to it? Did it break or something? No, I just rolled over. Just kind of dumb thumbed it? No, I, I took off and it was banking and it just rolled over. I had nothing. I had no oh, idea. Like the battery the servo got stuck or something. something. Wow. And it just tumbled out there. That sucks on any plane, but when it's that turbine, man, that's, yeah, especially one that gets just, pricey. Just got and made yesterday and yeah. It blew again this morning and blew right through the way. That's weird. The wheel collapsed, huh? That's not a good sign. Ooh, she blew over. <laughs> wow. That's why you go to a hobby shop where they, you know, they want you to be a lifelong customer. They don't want you to have failures on your first try. Yeah. <laughs> that aren't even your fault, you know. The thing is, this kid, the only experience he has on the cub and the simulator, that's not... <laughs> and jets are hard to fly. Just, yeah. They're just kind of hard to fly. You, you never know, though. With kids his age, he the simulator be might be enough. But there's got to be an end to this putzing around, I think, and just go ahead and throw it up there and see what happens.